the very first thing to do here is to draw the first horizontal line all right then from there i'm going to measure a mark of 10 and then downward okay a mark of 10 and then i'm also going to what project that horizontally okay so i'm going to project a vertical line on this plane in this manner okay and from this vertical line i'm going to measure a distance of 75 mm towards my left hand side distance of what 75 mm then on that mark of 75 mm towards my left hand side i'm going to watch project the vertical line on that plane also okay so after projecting the vertical line the next thing is this so towards this area yeah we have a circle of radius 22 so pick your compass and measure radius 22 and draw the half circle of radius 22 okay so with my radius 22 i'm going to draw my circle from here all right with my radius 22 i draw the circle okay after drawing that towards the right hand side okay so top on the right hand side here after picking your radius 12 place the radius 12 at the base here okay strike an arc upwards so wherever the arc touches this vertical line place it there and draw your circle but draw your circle of radius 12 from that area in this manner okay this is it here that has a circle of, of radio straight okay so towards this axis we have a point of what a point of 10 so we are applying the first principle of tangency which is principle of an arc you understand from a point so then with the radius of our arc which is radius 65 place it at this junction here yeah this junction here strike your first arc with radius 55 that's our what that's our first arc all right so then on this axis it is principle of what principle of internal tangency internal tangency so radius 55 minus radius 12 is what that's radius 43 with your compass measure radius 43 with radius 43 from the center of the circle here strike your second arc all right so after doing that we now pick our radius what radius 55 to draw the arc okay and with radius 65 from the point of intersection here we what we draw our arc which is this we draw our arc which is this all right after doing that we need to get for the bottom part here we need to get for the bottom part here all right so also we take note the radius for the arc on this bottom part is what is radius 55 while towards this area it is what it is principle of what principle of internal tangency which is what subtraction so 85 minus 22 that is 63 that is 63 with your compass measure radius 63 and draw okay with radius 63 I drew my first arc. That's it. Okay, so from this point here, from this point here, where our circle, where our circle touches the mark of point 10 here, that's where we are going to draw the second one. So we measure radius what now? Radius 85. Placing it at that point there, we draw our what? Our second arc, radius 85. Okay, with radius 85 from this mark of that 10 here, okay, on our circle, we strike our what? We strike our second arc. Okay, so after striking our second arc, this is where the arcs, what, this is where they intersect. So with the same radius 85, we place our compass right at the point of intersection, then draw the, what, the connecting arc. Okay, so with the same radius 85 now, place my compass at the point of intersection here. I'm going to, what, I'm going to draw. Okay, so that is the solution to this particular problem. Kindly ensure you subscribe to this YouTube channel and also ensure you refer it to your friends who might be in need of it. Thank you.